Now, as you all know, I'm currently in LA, which is in America, and get this, I'm hungry. Listen, steady on. So what happens if you put them all together? It's an American sweet can, is it, what's it called? American, American candy. Ca Anyway, I'm out here, there's American candy somewhere, I went to the shop and bought it, it cost a bloody fortune. We're gonna make a video out of it. The thing is, this video is really awkward to make because Ollie White is sat in the room. <laughs> and as far as I'm aware, you're one of the first people that came up with this, this like, this, this new trend that came about. I, mean, did I just did it. Next week I'm bringing back the Chubby Bunny challenge. Oh is yeah, it? that's what it's about. Shit. Let's try some American candy. Or sweets. Sweets. Candy. American sweets. <laughs> First up, we have Rocky Road. You get that in England. I wonder if it's going to taste any different. <laughs> Let's find out. <gasps> Do you know what? Packaging opens nicer in America than it does in the UK. Really? Yeah. Well, that was nice. Can we get a replay on that? Oh. Oh, it smells like chocolate, guys. It smells like chocolate. This is really exciting. It's just chocolate. Just chocolate and marshmallow. But you know, what's the sensation you're feeling right now? Take I'm it. feeling chocolate and marshmallow. <laughs> is, it? is that is that is that all I've got to do for this video? But, like, you've got to make make it look like it's um like a bigger thing. Like, but why? Yeah. I'm seeing chocolate and marshmallow. Because otherwise it's not. I can do that back home. It's exactly the same. Otherwise it's not going to be entertaining. Really? Mmm. <laughs> Mmm, that's a taste sensation. Ooh, give me goosebumps. Yeah. A little bit, feel that, feel that. Yeah. M&M's. What? Why? But maybe they're different because they're from America. Um, I've gone for the orange one, and I've also gone for, I think it's brown. I think you call it a dark. Oh, it's a brown. A dark. It's dark, no, it's brown. Okay, it's brown. orange and brown. Oh, it's pretzel flavor. Right. Tastes rank. I think, I think you need to make more of an effort to, um, to be more, a bit more entertaining. Really? Yeah, because at the moment you're sort of, you're not, you're not, it's quite boring. But I'm just, I mean, I'm, I'm eating, I'm doing exactly what I've got to do, just eat the sweets and no, say no, what. No, no, you need to be a bit more bubbly, like, you need to really enjoy the, the candy, uh, the sweets. Okay. Next up we have, maybe, this is an English sweet. Who put these in the trolley? Did you do that? I think I actually did. <laughs> oh! This, here we have a big cherry. I wonder what that tastes like. I reckon it's cherry. That's rank. Not nice. Damn rank. Is it not nice? No. Why can I spit it? Oh, do you want me to, I'll get you something. Hold, hold your hands out, are they? Yeah. No, f off. <laughs> this is a joke. I've seen people eat these. I've heard a lot about it. I've seen a lot of great reactions from it. Hershey's? Hershey's. Hershey's chocolate. Hershey. I've heard a lot about this. It's basically just milk chocolate. Nothing more, nothing less, but apparently it tastes a lot different. What did you just try and call it? Her Hershey, Her Hershey's. It's Hershey's. Hershey's. You, you absolutely melt. <laughs> Soapy chocolate. I told you when it's out on that Toblerone, Will. I told you, look, he's absolutely, like, he's nominated into it, isn't he? Look, he's already gone through half of it. Steady on, mate. Steady on. I know we're on holiday. Just calm down. Reese's Pieces. Smarties, but peanutty. Next up, you're not going to believe this, boys. You you're not going to believe no, it. No, no, no. You're not, not going to believe it. No. <laughs> We've got another Hershey. No! It's cookies and cream. Oh, boy. It's cookies and cream. T I C T A C's. Mounds. Dark chocolate coconut fills. Basically a bounty. Anyone want it? No, I do go on, you want it? Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I can go through another one, guys. I've heard a lot about this, boys. <laughs> a butter finger. This, this is like a this is like a bush tucker trial. I can't. I just don't, the thing is, I don't like doing stuff. That I don't know what and what I'm gonna expect. <laughs> think about dairy milk. Come on, Joe. Think about dairy milk. Think about dairy milk. Think about dairy milk. <laughs> Oh, stuck in my teeth. Oh, no. Sour Patch Kids. So I've got to go over the top. Yeah, yeah. Uh, in all the other videos, they like make it a really big thing, so you should make it like a big thing. Oh, okay. Because yeah. I was going to eat it normally. And no, then no, say no, what? You need to be loud, like be loud and, and excited. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Uh, is that right? Yeah. Pringles. 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 Salt and vinegar flavour. Oh, no, no. Ah! I think must stick I'm, not too, I'm not too worried about the salt. It's the vinegar. The, that about. vinegar. It's the... Ah. 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 Everyone says to me, Joe, when you come to America, you have to try this drink. What is it? What is it? No. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'll f with Sargi. He gets it down in eight. There you have it. There's me Joe, trying. Joe, Joe, Joe. I have one more thing. That's a banana. Yes, no, American banana. I'm not gonna lie. It looks pretty similar to to UK bananas. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. If you like bananas, you will love this. Try it. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to take this a step further, you can go to a restaurant and actually see this kind of stuff happen live, and you can even smell it. Anyway, I will see you next week with another Sug Sunday special. <laughs> right, I've had enough of this. I feel okay. sick. Wait, can we actually eat it now? You're about to open it the wrong way round as well. That's the I did this. Yeah, that's the right way. All right, mate. Way. All right, banana expert over there. Yeah. Jesus, well, I've got a PhD got in banana.